this is opening day weekend, week for the tribe. And when I was a kid, uh, I did go, I think, to four or five consecutive opening days. My father would take me out of school, take me down to the old stadium. And back then, it wasn't quite as hard to get tickets to opening day like it is now because the stadium was so big. And I still just remember the fact that when you would walk out in the stadium and just see the green grass and see how big the whole place looked with the lake out there beyond the bleachers, it was just a stunning sight for someone who was little. Um, the other thing I remember one time we went down was a cold opening day. And we followed it was the sun kind of around the park from section to section to section as the game went on, trying to be able to still sit in the sun. And of course, by about the third or fourth inning, most of the people had gone home. I think the Indians were getting hammered. But we stayed there to the end. We just kept moving around the park in the sections to stay in the sun. And the reason I bring up these memories, because somebody this week is going to be making opening day memories with their kids. And, you know, for others of us, it goes back to the old stadium. Or for some of us, it goes back even to League Park. You know, I do have heard a few people that remember going back to the old place there. And I'm so thrilled that they have done a lot of work on League Park to make it there. But I was thinking about this, and I don't have a good answer. Why is opening day in baseball so much more special than opening day of the NBA season, opening day of the, even the NFL season? I mean, think about it. There's 162 baseball games, or in this case, the Indians have already played six. You got 156 more to go, yet this is a big deal. You compare it to the NFL where they play 16 games, you think opening day would mean more. Compare it to the NBA, you play 82. Of course, what the, the NBA is uh, basically uh, wiped out the value of the regular season. Maybe that's why people uh, don't like opening day. But I covered the NBA for years, and it was never that big a deal. There was People, didn't, people don't sit around and tell opening day stories about basketball, football, or hockey like they do about baseball. And my only guess is because there are so many games and it's so long, it's sort of like running that first mile of the marathon. If nothing else, maybe I didn't do all 26 miles, but I got through mile one.